Gul, I'm interested. You have had an intense career. You started as an army wala, or army brat, should I say. You went to KVs in all parts of India, the northeast, the north. Uh, ended up even in Africa, if I'm not mistaken, as part of the Peace Corps when your father was in the army. From there, Miss India, then the Miss Universe pageant, Bollywood as an actress, and suddenly here in the EV industry. What gives in this journey? How did you get here? Um, well, uh, BRAT is actually an acronym for being relocated all the time. Ah, nice. Something I discovered recently. <laughs> and um, mm. I've, uh, I, growing up, I wanted to do many things and that didn't seem to set, sit well with everybody else. They said, you've got to pick one thing to do in life. And I said, no, I want to do many things. Um, entering the Miss India pageant was one thing I wanted to do, but it wasn't the only thing. It was not going to be an end in itself. It was a means to many ends. and. I, I chose to, by design and default, chose to go about doing things because ultimately I saw one thing as an enabler of the other. And my acting career has been an enabler of everything else that I've wanted to do, be it entrepreneurship, be it change in society, be it advocacy, be it um, facilitating debate, dialogue, discussion. So I've always seen my acting career as, uh, as perhaps about a one third of what I do because but it's very important because it is the enabler of everything else that I do. I think Miss India, in retrospect, was an enabler of the acting career. And I've tried to see life as a series of springboards. And I think the EV ecosystem, the electric vehicle ecosystem is a springboard into the future. And I think it is an enabler of a, of a, of, of a new lifestyle, of a new ecosystem, of a new way of living. And I want to be part of the, the party.